For years, economic growth has been seen as the way to improve humankind's well-being. But it came at a steep environmental cost. Now we know that growth and the protection of natural resources can go hand in hand. Green growth. But the relationships between economic, environmental and social outcomes are complex. The COVID-19 pandemic makes it even more challenging. How can we know that our growth is green? In 2011, several indicators were defined to track progress in aligning economic and environmental priorities. The so-called green growth indicators answer such questions as Are we becoming more efficient in using natural resources and environmental services? Is the natural asset base of our economies being maintained? Does the greening of growth generate benefits for people? How does green growth generate economic opportunities? In 2011, the Netherlands was the first country to pilot test this set of green growth indicators. Today, this measurement framework is widely used by the European Union and beyond to help policymakers make the decisions that stimulate economic growth and well-being while preserving the environment. The six Eastern Partnership countries, Armenia, Azerbaijan, Belarus, Georgia, the Republic of Moldova and Ukraine, also started raising awareness and developing their national sets of green growth indicators. Let's see what these indicators tell us. For example, the indicator for CO2 productivity shows that over the past decade, production across the EAP region has increased while CO2 has gone down. This means production has become cleaner and more efficient. This indicator shows whether the economy is decoupling growth from CO2 emissions, that is, whether the growth rate of CO2 emissions is lower than the growth rate of GDP. How are these indicators used in practice? Azerbaijan, Moldova and Ukraine developed reports that show progress in greening their economies. The government of Moldova is using green growth indicators to make better informed decisions. Belarus and Ukraine included green growth indicators in regular statistical systems and reports. This is a good start, but more work is needed. Green growth is about fostering economic growth and development while ensuring that the natural assets continue to provide the resources and environmental services on which our well-being relies. Green growth policies need to be supported with appropriate indicators to monitor progress. Green growth indicators can help track and communicate progress in greening economic growth, inform decisions, demonstrate accountability to national and international stakeholders, raise public awareness about the links between economic growth and the environment and compare progress between countries. The EU-funded EU for Environment programme supports the six EAP countries to better monitor progress at the Environment Economy Nexus. It helps reinforce the work on green growth indicators, update the existing sets and add new indicators and improve access to data. The green growth indicators that we design today will support the development of policies that will determine our lives tomorrow.